So I've thought about a lot about this on <clears throat> all these um, Puritans, uh, whether it's conservatives or if it's just uh, uh, these social justice warriors uh, complaining about games, you're never gonna uh, satisfy them uh, in any way because they don't like the art form of uh, games to begin with. And we we know this from uh, 20 years ago, uh, 15, 20 years ago, when uh, games were blamed for shootings and uh, all the problems in, in the world were blamed on uh, games instead of actually looking at the issues where the conservatives were going after uh, after the games. And Jack Thompson was the poster boy where uh he went after games like uh, grand theft auto and other games and now 15 years later we have the uh the other side of the coin where the left uh, the left puritans or the regressive left are now complaining about uh that games are sexist and violent towards women even though there are studies that s back it up that uh, they don't uh, um, make people more violent toward women or uh, uh, more violent in general so and and they, we constantly have this uh, argument where the these games are um, may, make uh, women look bad or are uh, sexist or misogynistic or any of these arguments and we need to promote uh, new types of uh, games where uh, we have strong female protagonists and this is a bullcrap because uh, there have been strong female characters for uh, uh, th uh, 30 plus years and uh, making the argument that we need to uh, stop buying these uh, killing simulators like uh, uh, God of War or uh, uh, Grand Theft Auto, or any of these other games that uh, that the these so social justice warriors are now advocating is uh, is bullcrap because um, if you look at the sales numbers, people enjoy these games and rightfully so because uh, uh, they they they're good games. You have fun playing them, and uh, you you shouldn't be shamed into not buy buying something. And I always use this example of um, where the social justice warrior failed time and time again, where you you have someone like uh, Tim Schafer uh, trying to pro pro virtue signal and all this type of stuff, and uh, Broken Age was pretty much a disaster because he got millions uh, of dollars and still managed to screw things up. You have Assassin's Creed uh, Syndicate, where uh, the year before they complained uh, Unity, where you, you couldn't play as a female in multiplayer, uh, even though uh, uh, it was supposed to be used, we were supposed to be a play as Arno in multiplayer, so you were playing the main character in multiplayer as well, so it would make no sense to play as a female character there. And you had Syndicate where it uh, sold worse compared to Unity. And Unity was a master, as we all know. Um, and then we have uh, a lovely example with Sunset where it sold a few thousand copies in its first month. And you have all these people uh, complaining about uh, Grand Theft Auto and all these games. But uh, they, they sell really well because they're fun games and that's all that matters for gamers it's not uh, it's not about uh, politics or, or uh, uh, genders or uh, homophobia transphobia sexism or anything like that they want to have fun games with good characters uh, fun gameplay uh, and that's all that matters. So, game developers shouldn't listen to these people because well, when uh, push comes to shove, they won't buy these games 
they won't put the the their money where their mouth is and uh, these developers shouldn't uh, should, should just ignore them they should listen to the gamers what do they want and not censor themselves and uh, do whatever they want instead of listening to uh, these puritans that don't want anything uh, to progress the the medium that is uh, video games uh, instead they want to uh, tie the developers hands behind their back and they want to fill quotas and uh, not make women look weak or or uh, tell whatever story they want so it's it's just uh, what I've seen as uh, so many times and I, I just want to vent my thoughts on this um, I'm gonna tr try to uh, do like a reaction videos or uh, or a reply to videos but my OBS is kind of screwing up I tried to uh, do this so I might just do a uh, hangout instead of until I get the OBS fixed so yeah uh, thanks for watching everyone and yeah see you guys next time bye